Hey guys, SuperTenderBoff here, and I'm just here with a quick little video about the iPhone. So, over the last few sort of days or weeks, there's been this sort of uh, annoying sort of rumour or actual real fact going around that apparently there's a bug, or a serious bug, in iOS 4.1. So, if you just uh, lock your iPhone, or iPod Touch, and, or actually probably it's just the iPhone, because only the iPhone has the emergency call feature, but, um, you know, if you've got an iPhone which requests a four-digit code when you want to log in, um, you obviously have a feature called emergency call. So if you press that, um, and then you get presented with the dial pad. Now if you press, for example, hash, 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 and then you press, I think it's the call button, and then you suddenly press the sleep-wake button at the same time, um, what will happen is the phone app will actually load even though you haven't actually entered the code in. It's weird and it's annoying, but it's obviously a bug and hopefully Apple will fix this. So let's just go and test this out. So, what is it, just the phone app? Yep, it does work. So as you can see, I didn't actually enter my code in and it still took me to the phone app. And obviously from here, I'm not gonna show you because it's got my contacts on there, but from here you get access to your contacts, you can go to the user's voicemail, but even more importantly, you can actually use the user's phone app, which is you know pretty bad because someone could charge you that way. Um, or they could just use your phone for calling anywhere they wanted to. So let's hope Apple gets this fixed. Now one other thing I did actually um, notice when you know when you do this is that now when you press the home button nothing happens uh, so at least the user doesn't get access to all your files uh, it's just a phone app uh, but nevertheless it's still bad uh, so Apple if you're watching this video or any other video which highlights this issue please fix this bug it's a big serious bug um, and it's a sort of big fail on Apple's part so let's hope they fix this in the iOS 4.2 upgrade um, I don't think you would get this error with the iPod Touch. I mean, you don't even have an emergency call feature on the iPod Touch because, after all, after all it's not a phone. Uh, but yeah, it does seem weird. So these rumours which have been going around about this annoying bug are actually true. Nice. Um, okay, well, just one last announcement from me, or two last announcement announcements. Um, Around a few weeks ago, I passed 500 subscribers, so thank you very much. It's a new milestone for me. Um, so, yeah, thank you very much to everybody who subscribed to my channel. Um, and lastly, what was it I was going to say? Oh, yeah, I have a Halloween special video coming up this weekend as well, so stay tuned for that as well. It's going to be a spooky XGO tutorial. <laughs> well, until next time, see you in the next video. Bye.